Hey guys, and welcome to my video. I got a whole new camera and audio, so hopefully this video is a lot, lot better for you guys. I do have a viewfinder now, so I'm trying really hard to not look at it right now because I want to like look at it, but then I know I'm not looking at you guys, so I'm trying very hard because I've never had a viewfinder before, so this is like really weird to me. Anyways, um, for this video, I'm going to be doing a Sephora haul because I went to Sephora yesterday and I got a pretty good amount of stuff, so I thought that I would share with you guys what I got in this video. I'm just going to go through this bag and show you the items I got. So I'm going to start off with the skincare products. The first thing that I got was this. So this is the Olhorenriksen <laughs> Find Your Balance Oil Control Cleanser. So basically it's just a cleanser for oily skin, which you guys know I have. I also have acne prone skin. So I really wanted to try a new cleanser, so I thought this one would be really good to try. It's supposed to reduce excess oil and cleanse pores. It's formulated with green fusion complex in neem seed oil. It's deep cleansing action helps unclog and purify pores without stripping skin. So I'm hoping this will be really, really good and help with my acne. The next up I got this, and I haven't heard anybody really talk about this, but I remember Sephora, I was looking through the acne section in their skincare, and this had almost all five-star reviews. So I was like, I'm gonna try that. So it is the Juice Beauty Blemish Clearing Serum, and it says it clears and hydrates with salicylic acid in COQ10. So it's like a serum. As you guys can see. So it's definitely like a serum style. It has a little dropper. It kind of looks like it would have like lemon in it or something. Like lemon juice. I'm not really sure. But um, it looks really, really good. It says on it. Um, mm, 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 it is 0.75% salicylic acid for acne treatment. But yeah, I'm hoping this will help with my acne. If not, the bottle's cute. So, you know, I'm still winning. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got this because I have saw everybody and their mother use this. This is the Kate Somerville Eradicate Acne Prone Skin Spot Treatment. It's basically like this pink liquid and you're not supposed to shake it. I was, I was told by the cashier at Sephora, do not shake this. And it also says on the top of the lid, do not shake. So whatever you do, if you come to my house, never shake this or I will find you. And I will kill you. <laughs> But basically it's like a spot treatment. It's kind of weird. It says um, use it at night. It's pink. So you like dip a q-tip in it and like spot on all of your pimples and it basically just helps to kill them. I'm not even sure what's in this to be honest. All I know is that if it kills my pimples, it'll make me happy. So that's this. It comes in this like little like medical looking bottle. So that's cool. <laughs> so I got some makeup brush cleansers because I've been breaking out and when I break out I start to think of every single reason of why I could be breaking out and one of them I thought is you know Chelsea you don't you don't really wash your uh, makeup brushes much uh, which we all know is very unhygienic so to combat that I got some brush cleaner <laughs> and this is the Sephora makeup brush shampoo 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 antibacterial formula so it's supposed to kill bacteria so I got this one and I used it already last night. I washed every single one of my makeup brushes because I'm so paranoid about it. But it just says that it's an antibacterial brush shampoo designed to deep clean your brushes once a week. So I'm definitely gonna try and do this once a week. Deep clean my brushes once a week. Make sure that they're clean, like really clean and not in with bacteria, cause ew. And then another one that I got just for when I'm filming like, just for like makeup looks so I can spot my um, eyeshadow brushes is I got the Daily Brush Cleaner, the Cleanse. It's a quick drying alcohol free brush cleaner. I think this is the one you don't need water. I'm pretty sure you just, yeah, you just spray it onto a cloth and then you just rub the brush on it and it just takes off any eyeshadow or something that's on it. So that's this one, just like in a little spray bottle. And then I got some makeup products, which I'm sure is what you guys are more excited about. So I picked up the NARS Soft Matte Concealer. It's like the one in the little tube, tub, not tube, little, little tub, <laughs> what am I saying? But I've heard so many good things about this. It has such good reviews on Sephora, so I really wanted to try it. And also my concealer was running out, so I knew I would need a new one. Um, I have, I already have the NARS Creamy Concealer, but I think I got it in the wrong shade. I got it in Creme Brulee, which I think is shade two, or maybe 1.75, something like that, but it's too pink for me. Um, I am very like yellow in my skin. So I picked up this one, which is light 2.75 in Canal, and I'm hoping this one will be yellow enough for me, so that's it there. I already used it today. I don't need my eyes. Oh, sorry. 
And another thing that I already tried out today, sorry guys, I like, you know, when I do my makeup and I have new stuff, I like can't hold back. Like I try really, really hard, but it's hard. I got the Cover FX Custom Enhancer Drops. These are insane. See this highlight I have on my cheekbone right now? Do you see that? Ooh, oof. It's this. And I got them in the color Sunlight because I wanted like a golden warm toned as I'm usually tanned. I'm tanned 90% of the time. Comes in like a little dropper and it's amazing. If you're looking for a liquid highlighter, highly recommend. They blended so well. I blended in with the beauty blender and my finger and it just looks amazing. It provides the most natural glow because it is a liquid. It just looks a lot more natural than a powder would on your face. And also they tend to last longer in the summer in the heat and stuff like that. I'll swatch it a little bit on my hand so you guys can see it. So I'll just drop one drop. So there's the drop on my hand and we're just going to, yeah. Yeah guys, that, that is real life right there. Real life. <laughs> like how gorgeous is that? The last thing that I got was a lip liner because I do have like a pinky, like the lip liner I'm wearing under this is kind of like my, my natural lip color, kind of like a pinky mauve lip liner, which is the one I always talk about, but I wanted to get one that was like a more nudie brown because I always like to wear nudie brown lips as well and I never had a lip liner. I had a cheap NYX one, but honestly it was crap. I like NYX's stuff, but the one I, the lip liner I got was not good. But this one I'm hoping will be really good. I swatched it in my hand in the store and it looked amazing. So it is the Kat Von D Everlasting Lip Liner and I got in the color Bow and Arrow because we all know that's like their brownie nude color. It looks like this. It comes in this really cute packaging. It's by hard for it to focus right now. Really, really cute packaging. I'm obsessed with that. It's one of the twist up ones so you don't have to sharpen it at all. But I will swatch it on my hand next to this highlight for you. It's like super pigmented. Yeah, like look at that. Insane. So that is everything for this little Sephora haul. I will link all the items down below that I purchased in case you're interested in purchasing them as well. Give this video a thumbs up if you haven't already. Leave me a comment down below if you like this new setup with my new camera and my new audio. It should sound a whole lot better and it should be a lot more HD, I'm hoping, because I did spend a lot of money on this camera in the audio. So I'm hoping that it is a lot better because you guys deserve better videos from me. Don't forget to follow me on my social medias. I have my Instagram, my Snapchat, and everything linked down below if you guys want to follow that. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys!